When you fire a traditional mortar shell, the percussion cap ignites and an explosion of gases sends it hurtling towards the target. But the noise and flash generated could give away your position. That's why Russia's developed this, a short-range silent spigot mortar called a 2B25. A promotional video explains how it works. It produces a sound equal to a shot from a Kalashnikov 7.62mm rifle with a silencer. So when the shell is fired, it is pushed off the spigot, out of the barrel, and this piston goes all the way down till it is caught by the constriction at the butt of the tube. And all the gases are produced by the propellant charge are trapped inside the tube. And hence, there's no sound, no flame, and no fume. It has the advantage of being fairly lightweight um, and very quiet, but the, the lack of range means that any team operating the mortar has to get relatively close to its target to engage it. But at the moment, the weapon seems to be um, predominantly used by uh, Russian forces. Um, it's a Russian design weapon and it's been in service for about 10 years. It's not a very widespread, uh, widely issued weapon. So it was a relative surprise to see them uh, you know, finally turn up in Ukraine um, in around December last year. So far, we've seen uh, at least two units operating the mortar, um, and both of them would fall into what we would, in the West, would probably describe as uh, recce forces or uh, special operations forces. And they're the, the sort of guys that are conducting um, scouting, raiding, um, uh, and reconnaissance missions. So it's it's not a weapon that's being used for saturation of a target. It's It seems almost as if it's either a weapon to support um, a, a small raid or perhaps uh, a weapon for harassment um, or perhaps a short fire mission where a team can move in, um, perhaps through uh, woodland, which we've seen a lot of, um, especially around the edges of Bakhmut, and find a target and then put 10 rounds down and then move away quickly. The relatively light weight of the mortar um, means that it can be man-packed, so it can be carried in the backpack. Once that's that fire mission's been carried out, they can pack up really quickly and move away. There's no Western equivalent to the 2B25, and it's not known whether Ukrainian forces have captured any. Meanwhile, the counter-offensive continues. Simon Hunter, Forces News.